good. No problems. Okay. Um, I shouldn't have eaten this hard candy. That was a mistake. That's okay, though. So. Okay. So, if you remember last time, I had some issues with OBS recording. So, I'm recording in Twitch Studios. Um, I'll probably just make the switch over to OBS. Doesn't really matter for you guys. But, for right now, we're going to have to do a 720... Uh, stream and recording which is kind of a bummer but it, it doesn't look too bad switch isn't even 1080 so <clears throat> um yeah let's do this oh, we gotta run around and do a bunch of stuff here huh so we're gonna do the first mission so that i can look at um so i can look at the advancement things and kind of plan that out and then we'll know for sure the plan. Um, I saw a idea that I thought could be fun was an all flyer run. Now, in the game, there's these things called battalions. Oh, I do have battalions, okay. Um, and the way battalions work is they're essentially just like special, special you like soldiers that you can activate as part of your main character's turn every character can have can lead a battalion right so the theory is that these guys are like the officers leading the actual army in battle um claude has a unique one called the immortal core corpse immortal core like corporation um and there are, it's just a group of flyers and i and someone mentioned to do an all flyer run which would then make um claude that you would essentially make like make his battalion right his special battalion which i thought sounded really cool so we i think we're gonna do that or, or we're either gonna do that or we're gonna do this 10 elites run that i have planned out over here that could be pretty cool as well um it has the idea is that claude so claude would be a bow knight Lorenz would be a bishop, which is like a magic user. Um, Raphael doesn't have, isn't in this. Lysithia would be a mortal savant, which I've made her before, and that's super good. Um, Mary Ann could be whatever. Hilda is a war master, but I think war master is tied to um i think war master is tied to something whose name i forgot what's it called oh males it's a male only thing which is why i have to look at the uh, the class upgrades but i don't think i can do that right now um and and then i would also in this run, I'd also have to recruit Ingrid, Annette, Felix, and Felix, Sylvain, and Mercedes, um, which is like almost all of the blue lions, which I just realized. That's interesting. <clears throat> and I do like them. Um, so it, that could be fun, but I don't know. We'll see. Do I have to talk to everyone? I don't remember how this works. I trust your e enjoy. If you continue to enjoy. Whoa, he definitely wants to What's kill me though. Wow, you really like I after that? I was I don't think I could hold my own against Yurita in battle. Do Not really a chance. Think so? I would definitely take you out, Casper. Caspar. Oh wait, we gotta go this way. I have a request. Oh, uh, yes, the greenhouse. Makes sense. I heard about the up goodness. Listen. Okay. What are you two talking Did about? Did you hear the news, Teach? Looks like we're gonna have a good old mock battle between the houses. 
The Golden Deer House isn't exactly what you'd call an elite group just yet, so you may want to whip everyone into shape with some extra training. After all, competition is only fun if you win. <laughs> to that end, you know, I was researching what it's like to live here long before I even enrolled. Want me to see? Students in town, um, yeah, you sure, as you wish. If you have it, you can try uh, the bullet. Uh, <clears throat> Barbie, maybe you know, all this stuff works. So, about the mock battle that's nope, coming? Nope, you have to as fight, Hilda. Maiden, I'm useless in battle. Gerald's first and best of it may have been only for a short time. Oh, uh, crap. She ran away from me. Well, there's Dorothea, Hilda, and Mercedes. Lady Ray. You know, Professor, I think I'm going to like it at the Officer's Academy. There are beautiful girls. Professor, I've got a small favor to ask. Just forget all about my assignment. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, did you come to look at the plants too? There are so many rare flowers I'd never seen back home. My adoptive father is the real expert. You should try looking around the greenhouse sometime if the mood strikes you. Zero. If you're looking for the greenhouse, it's right. All right, well, good talk, I guess. Monastery. I have had many great. I am hope. Yes. So I'm busy. Looks. Do you want something? Let's fight. I can't right now. But let. Ugh. Why can't the. Who should we hang out with? Let's go with Lysithia. And Marianne. Eating delicious food. I like this dish. Hey. I just saved 500 um, currency, whatever the currency nice. is called. I knew I could count on you. so much. 
Zobaczcie. So, if this were like an initial run, right, um, I probably would run around and talk to all these people. I'm, I think I'm going to skip a lot of the monastery stuff in this run, just to keep it a little bit succinct. Um, but, I, like in your first playthrough, you'd want to talk to all these people because you can get, like, um, you can get support points up. And as you gain support points, that's how you eventually recruit. Keep uh, students from other classes to your team so they can join you, right? Um, which is always fun. It's always a good time. I'm definitely going to spend all, the, all these on to get that. And then support levels. Mercedes and let's unlock her B as well. I, I do want to recruit Mercedes. Um, she's just so good. She's so strong. Her healing is so good that like you gotta have her. So I think we're good, right? Didn't I do both the both quests? Try to look at quests again. Yeah. L. Um. Sure. Why not? Oh dang! I can't look at. Uh... Okay, let's just go. Time for a mock battle, eh? Hmm. How should we go about this? Well, you'll be our commander, that much is for sure. Just don't screw it up and everything will be great. Got it, Teach? Leave it to me. Right. I'll do whatever I can to help, too. I mean, I'm kind of obligated to. For example, if I add a little something to their food to upset their stomachs... Come on, man. Be cool. Yeah, yeah. Wink, wink. I read you. You can't officially condone that sort of thing, right? But say, hypothetically speaking, students from the other houses started racing to the infirmary. As far as anyone knows, it could just be a harmless little stomach bug making the rounds. Well, well. What a fascinating conversation you two are having. May we join? Claude, I can't believe you would stoop to such crooked schemes to gain the advantage. Have you no honor? <laughs> if that was really my scheme, I wouldn't be talking about it out in the open. I'm afraid you'll have to wait until our battle to see what's really in store. It's irrelevant anyhow. Whatever you have planned won't save you from a crushing defeat. She has a point. Still, I'm rather eager to see what sort of schemes that mind of yours conjures up. You heard him, Teach. We can't let these fine folks down. They insist. Are you serious, Teach? Well, if a crooked scheme is really what you're after, I've got more than a few of those up my sleeve. Oh, how precious. Looks like you and the students have become fast friends. While I am pleased that you are taking the initiative to acquaint yourself with the students, I'm afraid it's about time for the faculty strategy meeting. I'm sorry, professors. It's about time I return to my training anyway. Claude, Edelgard, until we meet again on the battlefield, farewell. 
I look forward to assessing your abilities. I hope you don't disappoint. <clears throat> Why, thank you so much. I am grateful. I have gratitude. <laughs> Magic is dope. Operations are important. Um, sure, that's fine. That looks so funny. So, this is the stage for the mock battle. The command's all yours, Teach. I'm sure you already understand, but the house that defeats the other two is declared the winner. Incidentally, I'll be overseeing this mock battle, so listen well if you want to win. That's cheating, Gerald. Stay focused. I stand ready. Ready and willing. Who, me? Who, me? I will fight on the front lines. I can stop the enemy's advance with grace. Do you have Lady Edelgard's permission to... I suppose I have no choice but to provide cover. Thank you, Hubert. Ugh, we are off to a terrible start. Ash, can you move to the front lines? I want to lure the enemy this way. Got it, Your Highness. Leave it to me. Why would you have a, the archer Once finished preparing, the one moving make your the front move. lines? Did you, Mercedes, keep our enemy occupied until then? I'm on it. Oh my. We'll try our best. the iron axe. <laughs> All right, yeah, you stay down. Hilda, Hilda. Um, I could hit him with some magic. Man, it's still not like great. But I will let Lorenz finish him. Not that it matters. My whole plan was to try to get so that I could get uh, V. I'm gonna call. I'm gonna probably be calling him Byleth, even though I named him V. I should have just named him Byleth at this point. I was hoping I could reach Hubert and attack, but I did not. That feels worth it. Hmm. You are performing as expected, Professor. We will have to face you with our full might. And 
down he goes. The new professor is rather strong. I suppose I'll have to call it a day. A trivial victory. Nobles must... Goddess, protect me. Mm, I can't heal myself, which is a bummer. Let's go. Should we go this way? Let's see what direction they go. they will move forward until I get into position. Let's give it one more turn and see what we do, though. Are you planning on fighting two houses at once? I will admit that is favorable for us. This is a good opportunity for us. Nice. Oh, Let's I was wrong. They do push forward. I couldn't, I didn't remember that. supposed to be their healer? Shot at Dimitri. Here's, I think, what I. We're gonna play this defensively. We're gonna leave Claude here. We're gonna put Hilda over here so that they'll both come get attacked, but he won't be able to do whatever he did to, like, buff his defenses, making him impossible to hurt. Then you. How far up should I move you? Risk it. See how it goes. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. What's going to happen? There can be no victory unless I defeat you. So be it. Oh, she has a hand axe, and it hit me. Come on. He had a 50% chance to miss, and you hit him. Yeah. Or he hit you. Man, I'm taking a beating right now. Oh, hey, I've already matched the comm there. Good for me. Man, I wish I could heal even from just one space away. King Apple. Uh, 
Um, yeah, so I just started Golden Deer route. My plan that I, I still haven't fully decided. My plan is to do some kind of fun themed run. Um, I have, I've played through all four routes before and I've just been like itching to play some more. And so I wanted to jump back in. Um, my, I got some ideas from Reddit. So I'm either going to do an, an all flyer run, which could be cool. Or what someone called the 10 elites run. I haven't quite decided what I want to do. I'm kind of leaning towards the all flyer run. I feel like that sounds fun. But I just got to look at the the master classes and kind of plan out what I could make everyone. Especially because I have the DLC, so I know I can do the... Uh, I can't remember what the DLC flyer is called, but I know it can use magic, which was something that I was super bummed because the Falconites could do. My training was sensitive. All right, this could be bad. I may have been a little overconfident. Oh, Dark Flyer, that's the DLC one, right? Oh, you just healed Edelgard? Rude. Be mindful. Uh, yeah, let's take her out. The odds of beat me getting her so small. Yeah. Um, do you know, remember if Dark Flyers can heal? I feel like that's the only thing I'll end up missing with an all flyer run is I won't have anyone who can heal, which wouldn't be, it could add to the fun of the run, right? Where I just have to go in with what I've got, but. Perfect comprehension. Only, oh, only females can be dark flyers. Even, okay. Yeah, dude, too strong. So, okay, let's do this. Oh, I think I might do one HP off. Too strong, man. Too strong. Uh, I'm all sweaty. I'm still. I think I'm gonna do that. That's the one. That's the first one that, like, when I heard it, I was like, "Oh, this sounds really fun." The idea behind it is that it's kind of like you're kind of like you're pretending to be Claude's immortal cores, the his unique battalion. Yeah. So I think we're doing an all flyer run.
Um, yes, it is super good. I agree. Teacher. I wound up a patient go in my own infirmary. You can't compete with me. I have. So you've made it past Manuela, eh? I see now. I must focus and then make my move. Come on, hand man. You know you don't have no moves. Oof. Hmm. Can Claude get to her? Yes, he can. Nice. You're in your first playthrough? What, uh, what? House did you go? What place are you doing? My my, the new professor seems very capable. Each battle a chance to grow. Such power dwells within. Nice. Good level. Good level. Who, me? Oh, it's just your first playthrough on hard mode. Oh, I see. Gotcha. difficult I I enjoy the difficulty but I also play the game on casual and so I don't so even if I end up with like I get through the battle with one uh, unit left right I, I don't like backtrack as much as I think a lot of other people do so I'm more willing to accept the losses because I don't play permadeath <laughs> Oh, you went classic. I could use a break. It definitely gets hard. Yeah. Come on. I had an 85% chance to hit. Axes, man. He just healed himself. It's your call. Finishing hit. My goodness, the leadership of someone with Felix keeps dying. Experience oh. is I, I feel like I remember Felix as good having as a pretty useless. decent dodge. That's no? the golden deer for you. All right, that's that. The winner of this mock battle is the Golden Deer House. Great work, everyone. Even if it's just a mock battle, the taste of victory is uh, sure and sweet. Sense. Pretty low health. Work, Teach. That was a brilliant win. Everyone did well. 
Uh, playing ignorant as to the quality of your command and deflecting the praise to your students. You yeah, really are a model uh, professor, Teach. She looked just pretty to be honest, I had a bunch of other schemes planned as well, just in case the situation called for it. But I didn't have to resort to any of them. I suppose our opponents lucked out. Well met, Professor. The breadth of your skill was on full display today. I must admit that your tactics were masterful. I shudder to think what may have transpired had it been Claude leading us into battle. I noticed that too! We just did what you told us, and we won! I love it! As expected from a child of the former captain of the Knights. Thank you for today, Professor. I have much to consider. I never doubted that our professor would be amazing. It was way too obvious. Don't you agree, Marianne? Uh, me? Oh, um, yes, of course. Well done, professor. Aw, thanks, Marianne. Captain Gerald taught his child well. It would have been more of a surprise had our professor proved lacking. Don't you think it's a bit harsh to give Gerald all of the credit, Leonie? In any case, it's clear that we only won because of our new mentor's guidance. A mercenary's wisdom and techniques are forged in battle. This kids really know Those how to are the sorts of things on. you can only learn through experience. Right, Teach? But more importantly, it's time to celebrate our victory. Teach here has yet to try my well-renowned home cooking. I really do hope you'll join us. After all, I swiped some finely aged cheese from the dining hall for just this occasion. Your work with the students was remarkable. I can see Gerald trained you well. I do hope you were able to use the occasion to bond with the students. Y oh, you just finished a run three days ago and you're already starting another blue lion's run? It's crazy, man. Whenever I finish a game, I always have to like, take a break from the game before I can do more in it. Even if it's just, like I like to platinum a lot of games on PS4. Even if I, even after I finish one of those games, I have to like wait a few days before I go back and start working on like the extra trophies that I missed. Just cause I'm like, I gotta like cool down from the, from finishing a game. Like the, I guess the adrenaline for lack of a better word that I get from it. I don't know, it's kind of weird. Um. Yeah, we bonded. I'm so happy to hear it. Nothing would please me more than if you used this coming year to grow closer still. Of course, the mock battle was mere practice. The real fight is the battle of the eagle and lion, which will take place during the wyvern moon. You are expected to properly train your students so as not to humiliate the academy during the long-held tradition that is the coming battle. As for today, I have called you here to tell you of your mission for the month ahead. Is this your, your first Fire Emblem game? Or have you played some, some of the other ones? Causing trouble nearby. Bandits? What? Those affiliated with Garrig Mach Monastery have a moral obligation to help those in need, regardless of social standing. Students are no exception. Each month before the newly birthed moon departs, each house of students must complete their assigned mission. Gotcha. You shall work to complete the task at hand My first Fire Emblem game and was report back to the, the 3DS the games, games. Uh, specifically Awakening. I will soon you with that was my first Fire Emblem, and I, then I played mission. all the other ones that came to 3DS, now, and I loved I them all, but I, I so far I haven't gone back myself. to the older ones yet. I, can sense I would like to, but I have high just the, knowing that a lot of them are like permadeath only makes it hard for me to want to do it, because I know I'd have to reset a lot. But I'm sure I'll get to it eventually. Do you recall when we first met? You shall not fall so shamelessly again, correct? <clears throat> Have you no words for me? Do not tell me that you are shocked to hear from me. <laughs> you ought to know that I am always with you now. To hear my voice should not come as a shock. Right, yeah, I totally knew you were weirdly talking in my, in my mind. Of course. What is this nonsense? All I was told was to kill as many noble pipsqueaks as possible. No one said anything about the Knights of Damned Saros being on our trail. 
You have proven yourself worthless, distracted by something so trivial. I had hoped you would achieve your goal despite the setback. But now a child of the Knight's former captain is in play. How interesting. Hey, this isn't what I agreed to! Hiring a mercenary as a professor. What was that woman thinking? Are you listening to me? How do we finish this? You die. What? You can't just kill me. Underestimating the knights was an amateur mistake. One you will pay for. The road to eternal torment awaits you all. Now I must locate your replacements. Wait! Get back here! Oh, whoa. That's weird. Alright, man. Good night. Thanks for the follow and thanks for hanging out for a little bit. Clouds. Heartstring moon. Familiar scenery. In honor of the saints whose births or deaths took place under this moon, the people perform music once beloved by those divine beings. Whether by heart, by flute, or voice alone, kind of joyous melodies are shared between yeah, farmers as they sow their the seeds across the vast plains of Teltine and Grande. Sounds good. I'm hoping to that I'll be playing this for a while. My goal is always to stream for a couple hours every day, but I also work full time and stuff, so it's hard to get on every day. But I'll definitely be here. <clears throat> Five thousand gold, nice. As you have already been notified, your mission is to subdue some bandits. Our students have been learning about combat through study, but this is a precious opportunity to provide them with practical experience. The Knights will support your mission and are prepared to offer their assistance if necessary. In short, this is no mock battle. You must be prepared for anything. You will receive a message from the Knights when it is time to depart. Until then, use your time wisely. More bandits. Not very original, Teach. Not interested? Well, as long as you're with us, at least things won't be boring. In fact, it may take a turn for the interesting. And with that, I take my leave to make my final preparations. You seem well. Are you adjusting to life at the monastery? Um, yeah, I think so. We're, we're oh, blending in. I didn't expect that answer. When we were mercenaries, I handled everything. Outside of battle, you didn't have much contact with people, did you? I thought being thrown into a swarm of noble brats to teach would be a bit much for you. But I guess I had nothing to worry about. By the way, I heard about those bandits. Your first assignment is to take them out, right? That's fairly routine for you by now. But don't forget it's the first real taste of battle for those brats. It'll be tougher to sleep at night if you let one of your I little people die. Me messing with my Stay mind. vigilant and lead them well. I wish I could offer you my hey there, Annie Burnett. Ray What's up? Allow it. For now, I'll try to figure out what she wants from you. Yeah, I don't mind you settling into your life here. That's better. But don't let your guard down, ever. All right, I don't know what you were talking about, Gerald, but it's fine. It's whatevs. Hey, it's Annette's birthday. Let's send her some flowers. Ah, oh, perfect. That's exactly what I needed. Special. Okay, master classes. Wyvern Lord. 
get some flying. Scythia. So she would have to be a dark flyer. They'd have to all be dark flyers, really. Can wield magic effortlessly. So Wyvern Knight is gender neutral, but Falcon Knight is gender specific. Okay. Interesting. So Annie, if you're still here, my plan is to do a themed run for this playthrough since I've played through all, all four routes already. I'm just replaying Golden Deer because it's my favorite. But I think I'm gonna do an all flyer run. So now I'm just kinda, now that I finally have certification unlocked, I can look at the master classes. I'm just kinda thinking, just kinda planning it out. Hilda naturally fits into Wyvern Lord for sure. Lenny could totally be a Falcon Knight. Yellow just doesn't look that great. Lorenz wouldn't, ah, uh, he'd lose out on a bunch of magic though, which is a bummer. So, I would probably want to bench Lorenz because he's not gonna be able to do a ton. Um, Raphael probably do good great with axes. Ignitz, it wouldn't. I wouldn't gain a ton from it, but I could keep, like, I could keep a bow on him and continue using a bow. Lysithia and Marianne can both be dark flyers. Falcon Knight. So this would totally work. The only one who'd really suffer is Lorenz. So I'd probably have to bench Lorenz and recruit. I'm gonna recruit Mercedes. And then I'd probably have to recruit maybe like Ingrid or um, Petra. Petra would probably be a decent Falcon Knight. to use a flyer or a, a dancer in this playthrough though <clears throat> yeah she looks pretty cool as a dark flyer um okay so let's I can do a certification, sure, why not? Let's do... Let's just go with Normadon. We did it! Yay! So that's 5, 10, 20. So it'll be a little bit before I can get uh, what? Wyvern Rider, Axe, and Flying. Okay. What about females? Oh, they can be flyers a little 10. Then I 
it's 10, is it 10, 20, 30? I think special is also 20. So. But she can't use magic here, so it should be kind of useless. All right, anyways, I'm getting distracted. Let's go explore. Let's see what we gotta do. Um, girl's voice, what could it mean? What? Oh, she's still not here? Come on. Doing, Gerald? Hey, do you know how old Captain Gerald is? That's enough, Leone. If I don't know, how could my child know? It's not normal to forget your own age, you know. It's kind of worrisome, actually. By the time you're forgetting your own age, you're past the point of caring. <clears throat> I guess if you put it that way, you've got a point. Man, seeing them next to each other, it's clear that she I have a request. modeled so much of her outfit after Gerald's. Like the color scheme and stuff. To whisper about. Those bandits really didn't think things through, did they? They had to have known the knights would be after them the moment they entered the monastery's turf. Fine by me, though. I'm raring for some real combat experience. Any chance to grow is a good thing. Is there anything else you want to ask me, Teach? About living at the monastery or combat? Anything like that? Here at the in other words, student, if you want. Uh, uh, they have fun. Is there anything else? Your performance in the mock battle was exceptional. Perhaps we could train Thank together you. sometime. I am exceptional. I would love to. Um. We're good. All right, so let's go to the dining hall. Okay. I guess we got a bunch of side stuff to do. Professor, hello. I was just looking for my... Well, it's... It's like a pale blue cloth. Thank you so much. Oh, Can I recruit I was... you already? I do find you very... Interesting. Oh, okay. Rude. Oh, Shamir. Have we How could I forget about Shamir? Yeah. Sorry. Shamir's great. I married her in my church playthrough. Um, Prophet, I'm... I should probably stay behind. Yes. Do something for me. Some bonding bites. Let's see with these two. Why not? <clears throat> There's more food than I don't listen to him, Professor. <laughs> What up, Aloise? Hello there. You there? Jarrett, uh, how you doing? So, uh, gatekeeper. Greetings, Professor. All important Nothing person to, to talk to. Are you settled in here at the monastery yet? Make sure to have a good look around. There's much to see. Like fish. You do know about the pond behind the dining hall, right? You can fish there. Give it a try. Nice. Uh, this is where I learned I to talk to help. animals. I need your help. Yay! I remember 
this game first came out and you couldn't interact with the pet with the dogs and cats here everyone got so mad that's so funny that they added that so that you could interact with them so what you there they were like internet mad you know what? they weren't actually mad hey. they just talked about it a lot mm -hmm. Fast? I don't remember how to fast travel. Is it square? No. There we go. Whoops. Oh, I haven't been to the cathedral yet. And now oh, that was pretty fast. Wasn't bad below time. Um, what's you doing, Rhea? I'll talk to you real quick. Thank you for. Is there anything troubling you? Or is there, um, perhaps, something you seem to be getting along well with the students? Right. I can often be found here, so... Alright, well, good talk. <clears throat> what? Well... Thanks for your help. My barracks are full? Oh my gosh. I didn't even know that could happen. Can I sell my barracks for my battalions? That doesn't seem right. Open sesame. <laughs> well. Oh, I dropped my lid. Favor to ask. You do. Oh, I haven't unlocked it yet. Oh, because I had to talk to him first. Do you like oh, the same as Mercedes? Did you come to pray to the goddess? I did. Oh, me too. Oh, crew? I'm already having so much fun. Ah. Fine. Inside, Saint. Saint Saint. Now that you. Inside the cathedral, there is Saint in Now that you are, I have something to ask of you. But for informal in the cathedral, okay. Something else. Wait, what are these support things? Oh, what do we got? I think we'll watch the only... a moment. There is a matter well, of significance I'd like to discuss with you. I know you're always seeking the attention of ladies, but why are you wasting your breath on me? Don't be silly. I want to discuss the future of the Alliance, to have a constructive and candid exchange of opinion. I'm not so sure I'm the one being silly. Actually, I'm busy. Stuff to do. Now, hold on just a moment. House Ordelia will never benefit from such a narrow-minded mentality. I was under the impression you were interested in me as a person. What do house matters have to do with anything? As it stands, the bonds between Alliance Lords are quite weak. If this state of affairs persists, I'm afraid those bonds may dissolve entirely. I couldn't care less. Oops. House Ordelia may be small, but a small house is fettered by fewer obligations than a larger one. Apply yourself as an unopened pack of fruit snacks. Negotiate wisely, and you can do much to maintain peace among the neighboring lords. 
the recognition of those lords would benefit your house immensely. Need the sugar-free peppermint. To that end, why not start with me, the heir to House Gloucester? All the hard candiness. Friends, could it? Not quite as much. Yes, yes, of course. When the time comes. But right now, I'm quite busy. Maybe later. As it is. I was. I'm. I'm gonna be honest. I'm not really paying attention. Okay. Sorry. Gotta run really? really fast. Uh, I was thinking, Professor uh, Frigid, Almira, Fesker. Word of advice, Professor. I think I'm gonna. Well, I'm not gonna use Anna. It doesn't even matter. I was gonna say I'm gonna wait to intruder, but. You're a lifesaver. Find them both, okay. So, yeah, my savior, thank you. Both sing with Hilda and Dorothea. I'm sure I'll recruit her eventually. Singing's okay, but I should really have a I'll keep my voice down. Don't want people thinking I'm hmm. <laughs> So well done. You have my thanks. Hmm. Alright, I think we did it. I think we did all of them. I think we can finish exploring. Does is everyone at least is everyone happy? Goals? Is that how you see it? Oh, Hilda is not. Okay. Is the water supposed to be this cold? God, my hand slipped again. Hey, what's, he doing? what's that noise? What are you doing? Sorry. I'm sorry, okay? Another fine mess I've gotten myself into. What happened, Claude? You're soaked. The student whose turn it was to do the dishes today was ill, so I volunteered to take his place. Wow, the dining nice hall maid was on my case the whole time for breaking plates and getting water everywhere. Actually, not everywhere, mostly on myself. It was just one big mess. It wore me right out, too. I can really use a nap about now. <laughs> you might be a noble with a fancy bloodline. Being noble or common doesn't have anything to do with washing dishes. Oh, I dare say most nobles would refuse. I agree, okay. I prefer it your way. You don't act like you're better than <laughs> I'm honored that you acknowledge my greatness. And I'm rather fond of your blunt way of- Really? To be honest, I don't actually trust my own ability to re- I like to look for the good in them, but that doesn't always mean it's real. I mean, you seem like a good person. But your heart could be black mm -hmm. for all I know. You say you can't figure people out, but what you said just now is pretty shrewd. It's wise not to trust appearances alone. I'll keep that in mind. Though, no, I'm not sure I should be taking advice from some- <laughs> So... 
We recruit Petra to be a Falcon Knight. Ingrid to be a Falcon Knight. And maybe Shamir. <clears throat> I guess that feels like a lot. I'm trying to remember how many I, I feel like 10, 10 feels right to me. Like that's how many we've had, how many people uh, permission we've had in the past. Oh, you know what though? If if I want to be able to use, um, what's it called? If I want to be able to use adjutants, they also have to be flyers. Hmm. Tricky. So, classes. Axe and flying. So let's get everyone's flying to C, I think. So let's keep their main weapon and flying for everyone. Ah, uh, Lorenz. You can do whatever you want. I'm gonna bench you. Let's change that. Let's do axe and flying. Ignis is bow and bow and flying. Lysithia is reason and flying. Marianne is also reason and flying. Hilda is gonna be axe and flying. And then Leonie is lance, no, lance and flying. I know Leonie's like a bow, a bowman usually, but she'll be fine with a, with a spear or a lance. And then Lorenz, I don't know, do whatever you want, man. Um, yeah, let's do this. And then, gosh, keep reading the buttons. Go back to my personal quarters. Um, skill levels. So to bump everything that I will need. Let's bump this. So I can train everyone. Let's bump. Rank. And then reason just to be for now. Lance to be. Let's just bring everything to B skill for now, just so I can make sure I'm training everyone in it accurately. And then bow to be. How does faith work in terms of putting skill points into it? I can't remember how that one works. So I can get it unlocked as a hidden ability. Is anyone, I don't think anyone's working on swords right now, but we can unlock some better sword skills as well. And then as far as recruiting people, 
We want Petra and Ingrid. I think Shamir, I don't really need to spend points on because I think hers is pretty easy to unlock. Um, should I get one more magic user? Let's think about it. So I'll have bow and axe, 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 magic, magic, axe. So I think I need to bring a couple more magic users, not... Who should I get then? If I'm getting magic. Should I bring a net as well? I feel like I didn't really use a net very much last time. Um, they have to be female because I'm using... I'm, I have to make them a dark flyer. So probably Dorothea. And let's go net as well. Let's go from there. See how it goes. <clears throat> What's this class ability? Hmm, I made him a dark flyer at one point. Or I guess it would have been a her, because only females can be dark flyers, but. Okay. That's good for now. Let's finish exploring. Don't tell me. No one bothered to show you the standard procedure for lectures? They gained skill experience, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I think I remember how to do all this. Claude, what do we got going for Claude? <clears throat> so let's do flying. I think I want to try to get flying up to C for everyone first, and then I can kind of ignore flying for a little bit and have them focus all on their weapon skills. So let's try to get that up as fast as possible. Getting perfect is tied to um, tied to your ranking with them, your support rank. So it would be easier. Um, I had a higher support rank. Let's have Ignitz do it, just because he'll be the hardest one to level up. And let's have he can only get he can only get B ring together. That's weird. Let's have him work with Marianne. Goals I already have set up. I think we're good there. Begin lecture. Professor, may I ask you something? 
How much do you never time to deal with sleeps and nuisance? Do you have any tips for shaking tired feelings away? Oh, T's always asking me things, uh, baby. Hmm, that wasn't a great answer for her, apparently. What's up, Claude? Hey, Teach. I see you're as stony-faced as usual. Hmm, I can't tell if you're feeling resigned or if you're just lost in thought. Or maybe you simply don't care about anything that's going on. Oh, sorry. I really didn't mean to be rude. I just find you fascinating. Actually, there's something I'd like to talk to you about. Sure. That's just the sort of attitude I'd expect from a new teacher. Speaking of, before you came here, you were a mercenary, right? Oh, it's a bit unusual that you suddenly decided to become a teacher one day. So this is a support In any case, I I've been meaning to ask, right now. did your father teach you how to fight? I figured your father used to lead the knights, didn't he? And I hear he was a legendary mercenary. It must have been hard on your mother when you followed in your father's foot. I see. I suppose you grew up... You know, for someone who's right around the same age as me, you certainly have an unusual... I guess it's only natural that you'd be different from young nobles who grew up in... <laughs> well, even so, I am heir to House Regan, the leading family, but I didn't exactly grow up in luxury like most people of... Hey, maybe that's why you and I get along so well. Folks like us should stick together. As house leader, I'll do all I can to help you out. We can start by making time for... Nice, his motivation went up. We'd better get to work. I'm ready. Well, we did it. Anything to make Raphael happy. He deserves it. Okay. Before I do this battle, I'm gonna take a really quick break to start a new recording and to switch my laundry real quick. So I will be right back.